New at 4.30, a neighborhood's battle against proposed development continues to get a lot of attention. A current change.org petition centered around a Piper Glen development has nearly 20,000 signatures against a rezoning petition. WCNC Charlotte's Julia Kaufman shows us why some neighbors are against the plan. We're on the four mile greenway here in Piper Glen and on the other side of these woods, developers want to build apartments and a retirement community, but homeowners are against the development. Even on a rainy day, people in South Charlotte love the four mile greenway. Long, spacious greenways, lots of nature. Charlotte native Chris McIntyre and his neighbors are fighting to preserve that nature. 70% of the trees will be wiped out on 53 acres. The proposed Sutherland at Piper Glen development calls for 640 rental units on the other side of this creek. That's just really dense. McIntyre understands the land will be developed, but he'd prefer to see houses for sale. Some neighbors want the land untouched. Councilman Ed Driggs says that's not an option. The county expressed an interest at one point to the owner uh, in buying the site for a park. The owner said, I don't want to talk about that. It's under contract. Under the land's current zoning, the developer can build about 470 homes, but no apartments. Driggs says rezoning the property for higher density could save more trees and improve roads, but more negotiations need to happen. Unless some sort of an understanding can be arrived at with that group and with residents uh, in a larger scale, I won't support it. The project has a public hearing Monday at the Charlotte City Council meeting, and it's expected to be a packed house. In Piper Glen, Julia Kaufman, WCNC Charlotte.